Why every time I check my feed, I feel so blah about myself? It's as if everyone's better than me or having more fun. Yep, I get you, sis. That's why I quit social media. You can do that? <laughs> Sure you can. My head was about to explode, so I deleted most of the apps for a while. Wait, so what is it that you're doing now? I'm watching a very interesting video about global warming and... Boring. It's better than watching Mr. and Mrs. Perfect over there. It's Brandy and David. Sweet, sweet David. <laughs> no wonder you feel bad about yourself. Social media is designed for you to feel that. What do you mean? I was hoping you'd ask. Come with me, I'll show you. Uh, where to? Into your feed, where nothing is how it seems. Brandy, Ugh. from all places, why do we have to land here? Look how perfect she is. Well, duh, she's an influencer. She gets money to post these. Someone actually paid her for that? If you'll just widen your perspective, you'll see it's nothing but an ad for soda. So it's all just a big hoax? I've been living in a lie! <sighs> <sighs> Come on, turn off the crying filter. I mean, social media can be really great. It's full of fun things and interesting ideas. It's just that if you start comparing yourself to everything you see, your head connects. Ruth? Ruth? There you are. <laughs> Look how perfect they are together. Of course they are. So you agree with me. They pick and choose only the moments that look perfect. They won't show when they are fighting oh. or how they look in the morning. <gasps> even though it seems like that on social media, no one is perfect. Not even Brandy. You really think so? I know so. Aww. Thanks for showing me what's really going on on my phone. We need to celebrate this moment with a selfie. Hey, no, I told you I'm out. Come on. Fine. <laughs> <laughs> Ruth and Eve are so lucky to have each other. I wish I had someone like that. Hey, did you say something, babe? 